All right, on a different note now, just days after a pharmacy in Loudoun County gave the wrong COVID-19 vaccine doses to young kids using adult vaccines, another parent is coming forward. Yeah, she says a different pharmacy also administered her son an incorrect dose of the child COVID-19 vaccine. Matthew Torres joining us live from the CVS on Russell Branch Parkway in Ashburn. So Matthew, what exactly is mom saying about this? Well, Larry, first off, CVS is confirming what happened according to what this mom says. She says the pharmacy over diluted her son's vaccine, downgrading the efficacy. And while health experts say there are no known side effects, it's still frustrating for this parent. My biggest concern is that he got an ineffective dose. Gerbert Gill's 11 year old son walked out of this CVS in Ashburn on Monday with a shot of the children's Pfizer vaccine. But days later, a voicemail signaled something was wrong with his shot. And this is in regards to important information uh, about a vaccine recently received. The Virginia Department of Health confirms it received a report about a vaccine administration issue at the pharmacy. CVS Health says three patients on Monday received a vaccine that was diluted too much, administering an incorrect and lower dose. It's frustrating, right? Like we, we wanted to get our kids vaccinated because we have travel plans at the end of December. She was told to bring her son back to get vaccinated again per CDC recommendation, but she's holding off until she gets advice from her pediatrician. This comes days after Ted Pharmacy in Loudoun County was stripped of its ability to provide COVID vaccines after giving incorrect doses to 112 children from 5 to 11 by diluting shots meant for adults. But in this particular instance, we went somewhere where they seem to have misunderstood what the guidance was. Surya Lamech's 8 and 10 year old sons received one of those doses. Unlike Gil, he was instructed to wait for his child to just get the second dose. It's a little worrying to not know exactly how protected they are. The Loudoun County Health Director says there's been no other cases of adult vaccines being diluted for young kids, but acknowledges on occasion an issue arises where a product was not correctly diluted or an incorrect dose was provided. When we hear about such an occurrence, we work with the pharmacy to ensure the affected patient receives the correct information on what occurred and receives guidance on next steps. But maybe we just need to be a little more aware and we and uh, make sure of what they're getting, but I hope it doesn't deter anyone from getting vaccinated. And today, the State Board of Pharmacy says it cannot uh, confirm nor deny if they are investigating Ted Pharmacy. As far as CVS, the spokesperson says they are taking steps to make sure this does not happen again. Reporting live in Ashburn tonight, Matthew Torres, WUSA 9. Also, if parents have questions about any of these mix-ups as well, they should be speaking to their pediatrician. Matthew Torres reporting live for us tonight. Matthew, thank you.